So today I'm talking about a Honda with the P1253 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. And so what is a Honda P1253 code? Well, it's a VTEC system malfunction. And what does this mean? Well, Hondas have this system called VTEC. Some people call it variable valve timing or VCT. It's going to vary a little bit depending on the year of the Honda. But basically the VTEC system allows for a better performance at like high RPMs because it can adjust and control how the valves are opening. And it also allows the engine to get better fuel economy when it's at a lower RPM. And so what are some possible causes of a Honda P1253 code? Well, first thing is going to be low or dirty engine oils. So be sure to check that. Oil is running through the VTEC system. And so if the oil's low or if it becomes really dirty, then it can affect it. So first thing, be sure to check your oil. And then, of course, the next thing that can affect this is going to be the VTEC itself, which is made up of different components. You're going to have like a pressure switch on it. You're also going to have a solenoid. Newer Hondas just have like a solenoid that slides in and out. Like I said, it's going to vary a little bit depending on the Honda and the year and everything. These systems, since the oil flows through these systems, they have these little screens that help to keep debris out or anything that's flowing through the oil. And quite often, these become clogged up and they need to be cleaned out because they're blocking the flow of oil, which can lower the oil pressure and just cause issues. And so this is definitely something to keep an eye out for again it's going to vary where it's located but these very commonly become clogged up and need to be cleaned up a bad oil pressure switch can also cause this problem there can be two and sometimes there's four again it's going to vary but the oil pressure switch that's located on the VTEC is a very common problem with these and so they can be tested or replaced they simply screw in and out of the VTEC for example right here in this example up against the firewall Here's the VTEC, and in this particular Honda, this oil pressure switch went bad and just needed to be swapped out and replaced. And keep in mind that anything wrong with the wiring going to the oil pressure switch, if it gets damaged or if there's an open or a short or anything like that, then it could cause the same problems as a bad switch. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to give a basic overview of how you go about fixing a Honda with the P253 code. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe, and have a good day.